Hi, I'm Matt Whelan, Technical Support Specialist here with today's Tech Tip. With the holiday season approaching, many of you will be purchasing gifts online for your family members or maybe yourself. Online shopping has become a popular way to purchase items without the hassles of traffic and crowds. However, it is important to take steps to protect yourself when shopping online. Unlike traditional shopping, where you know that a store is actually a store it claims to be, attackers can create malicious websites or email messages that appear to be legitimate. Attackers may also misrepresent themselves as charities, especially after natural disasters or during bus busy seasons. Attackers create these malicious sites and email messages to try to convince you to supply personal and financial information. If you do not take steps to protect your computer from viruses or other malicious infections, an attacker may be able to gain access to your computer and all of the information on it. Here's a tip you want to remember before providing any personal or financial information. Make sure that you are interacting with a reputable, established vendor. Some attackers may try to trick you by creating malicious websites that appear to be legitimate. So you should verify the legitimacy before supplying any information. Locate and note phone numbers and physical addresses of vendors in case there is a problem with your transaction or your bill. Also be wary of emails requesting information. Attackers may attempt to gather information by sending emails requesting that you confirm purchase or account information. Legitimate businesses will not solicit this type of information through email. Do not provide sensitive information through email. If you receive unsolicited email from a business, instead of clicking on the provide link, directly log on to the authentic website by typing the address yourself. Now, when it comes to purchasing your items, use a credit card if you can, because there are laws to limit your liability for fraudulent credit card charges. Whereas a debit card draws money directly from your bank account, unauthorized charges could leave you with insufficient funds to pay other bills. You can minimize potential damage by using a single low limit credit card for making all of your online purchases. Finally, check your statements and keep a record of your purchases and copies of confirmation pages and compare them to your bank statements. If there is a discrepancy, report it immediately. I hope you found these tips helpful. As always, you can contact Shell Point's Technology Support Services at 454-8248 for more information regarding computer security updates or other questions.